Fine, uh, drag queen and comedy show available here also and I will just take you and show you inside beautiful and I will take you around and show you inside so there's the name up above chapter 2 an area and then these are the lagoon rooms 3106 this 3107 38 all along the back there and there's your swimming pool the rooms are located and the swimming pool and then here's all the rooms in the back here and there's the swimming pools and then there's a swimming pool area oh la la and we have some steps down and there's your swimming pool many many training shoes running all the way along the back there all different brands oh will you look at these some snakeskin shoes there some snakeskin in the bottom there you even have the swing here, Tiger Richie Bumba. Good morning, good afternoon from Bali, Indonesia. So today I'm here in the Legian area of Bali and what I'm going to feature in today's video for you is a walking tour along a very popular tourist street called Jalan Workudara. So what I'm going to feature in today's video is a walking tour along a very popular tourist street of Jalan Workadara which is laden with many hotels, restaurants and shopping options available on the street there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off at the Jayakarta Resort and walk all the way through to Jalan Legian, taking in all the restaurant, warung and shop options along the way. The hotels, I'm going to take you inside and just give you a general idea of what the hotel looks like inside and around the swimming pool area. I'm going to take you inside all the restaurants and show you what they look like inside. I'm going to try and include menus where available at the restaurants. So without any further ado, let's go and get started and share with you the street of Jalam Workadara. Oh la la, will you look at that for a view? Wow. Okay, so I'm going to start my tour here of Jalam Workadara at the Jayakarta Bali Beach Resort Residence and Spa. That's the main entrance straight ahead. There's the sign there telling you it's the Jayakarta. This is Jalam Workadara, a little bit in that direction. We're not going to start there. We're going to start the coffee shop across the road and then we're going to make our way up there and turn left around the corner. So just there we have a mini mart convenience store directly across the street from the Jayakarta. We have the ink parlor, tattoo studio. I have a tourist goods shop selling um, tra uh, train shoes, handbags, etc. And then just here we're going to start at Coffee Cutters Barber and Barista Bar. So we're Australian owned. There's the details from 6am. There's a little bit of what's available here. And then, let's just zoom out. Excuse me, Okay, we'll just give you a view inside the little seating area here at the coffee cutters. Have a nice little seating area in here. There's a name on the wall. The barbers is in the back there. And then we have a nice little seating area here by the roadside. So we'll show you inside the barbers as well. We've just been given permission, 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. And there's the inside of the barbers. Ooh la la, beautiful place this inside. Air conditioned, super cool. Okay, so just from the coffee cutters, barber and barista bar in the corner there, we're just moving along the street. Just here we have a place called Mimpy um, Barley Spa Body Treatment, just in the back there. And then just moving along the line, we have a place called Sendok a Mass Bar and Restaurant, just on the corner here. Okay, so here's Sendok and Mass on the corner. This is Jalan Workadara where we're going to be heading. Just in this direction is Jalan Padma Utara. Many shops, bars and restaurants in that direction. Okay, so just at the main entrance now to Sendok and Mass Bar and Restaurant. Special on the Bintang beer deal. Have a drag queen show here also. I'll just take you around and show you inside. This place is just opening. 
I have a beautiful collection of tables and chairs right through here. Okay, so just from the Sendok and Mass Bar and Restaurant, just on the corner here, we have the Zest Hotel, also attached the J and Bar and Restaurant. Okay, so just up here on the rooftop now at the Zest, just to the right there, we have some toilets. Just to the left here, we have some showers, outside showers. And then just up these stairs here, we're gonna take you to the swimming pool. So we're just at the back of the swimming pool, have a nice big collection of sun lounges here. And then we have a swimming pool just leading off the edge there. So just on the top here, we have a big seating area. And then there's a swimming pool down below. Okay, so just coming out of the Zest Hotel with a trip in there to see the swimming pool. Next along the line is a place called JN Bar and Restaurant. So he's attached to the Zest Hotel. Take you around and show you inside. Nice collection of tables and chairs there by the roadside. So wooden tables and chairs here running all the way down the middle, flat screen TVs. And just in the back here we have a beautiful seating area, soft cushion seating area. Okay, so there's a full span of the bar, runs the full length of the bar here. And then here's the opposite end of the seating area. Nice collection of tables and chairs running all the way down the middle. Okay, so there's another angle on the JM Bar and Kitchen from across the street and then just on the opposite side of the street we have a Pamata Bank. This is a great place to use the ATM machine. Okay, so this is the Pamata Bank just behind the tree there and then just on the, opposite, on the same side of the road we have Indo Inc Tattoo Studio just across the street there. Have a tourist goods shop selling lots of tourist goods, handbags, glasses, shirts etc in there. And then just next along the line we have a place called Yanti Bar and Restaurant. So we'll just take you across the street to Yanti Bar and Restaurant. There's the name on the sign there. Drag Queen and Comedy Show available here also. And I will just take you and show you inside. Beautiful collection of tables and chairs in here. Nice wooden tables and chairs to the side. There's a bar area. We have all the tables and chairs all the way down the middle. Okay, so just on the opposite side of the street from Yanti Bar and Restaurant, now we're on the um, opposite side in Rejuve Day Spa, Beauty Hair Nails. That's just in the back there. All the girls on the stairs there. Hello, good afternoon. And then just on the other side of the street, we have another Rejuve Day Spa. We'll take you across the street and show you. There's all the girls outside. Hello, good afternoon. Okay, so just next door to Rejuve Nails and Day Spa, we have a place called Chania Tailor and Leather. That's just in the back there for all your handmade um, leather goods, wholesale and retail. Okay, and then just across the road from a leather goods made to order, we have a place called Sawasti Car. This is a Thai restaurant. We'll just take you across the road and see see the offers here. So here's the happy hour offers, 4 to 8 p.m. Here's the Thai food available. All the dishes on the board there. And then just in the back here we have a pond as we enter inside. Straight ahead there. We have a nice seating area to the right here. Bar area in the back. And then we have these beautiful seating areas up here. Let's give you a close up. Ooh, la la. And then here's a main restaurant area in the um, top here. Nice collection of wooden tables, wooden chairs, soft cushion seating. Okay, so just on the opposite side of the street, street from Sawasti Car, the Thai restaurant and bar, we have a collection of tourist goods shops here. We've just been given permission to take you inside and show you around this one. 
So just on the side here we have a nice collection of caps available, all different designs and brands there. Ooh la la. And then just in the shop we have a nice collection of singlets for men, some ladies handbags up in the top there, some kiddie shirts down here, also some baby bintang shirts on the side there, beautiful collection of handbags on the wall there also. Just to the side here has also a collection of perfumes, lighters there, and also some sarongs. Also belts there on the wall. Okay, so we have a tourist goods shops here, the Thai restaurant Swasti Car, and then next in line we have nice bar and restaurant. Okay, so we'll take you across the street now to nice bar and restaurant. We'll just show you some of idea of the menu and cocktails and drinks and things available here. There's some of the menu available. All day specials here on this menu. Here's the promo on the beers for the happy hours, 27k all day long. Some more food options available here. And then just a last special menu here. And now we're going to take you around and show you inside. A nice collection of wooden tables and chairs inside, counter area over to the back there, all the way through, and some flat screen TVs on the wall. Okay, so just across the street from Nice Bar and Restaurant, we have the Goat Pub of Legian. It's just on this, in the back there. We're going to take you around and show you inside. Have a beautiful seating area here. It's by the roadside. The goat at Legian, Legian $5 steak lunch. Okay, so just on the opposite side of the bar now, we have a friendly person here. And then just in the back here, we have a pool table and many flat screen TVs. Okay, so just from the GOAT, the pub of Legion, we have a convenience store across the street there. And then next um, in line, we have a place called Palmer Palace Restaurant Bar and Grill. So we just take you across the street to Palmer Palace, no plus plus, five dollar neck, cocktail from 2 to 7 p.m. There's the breakfast menu. Bucket of five bottles of crystal, 170k. And then now we're gonna take you inside and show you around fixed price menu, no tax, no service. And here's the inside seating area. Nice collection of wooden tables and chairs in here, all the way through to the back there. Okay, so just from Palmer Palace, just next door, we have a place called Payne Louver, clothes leather tailor, also dolphin shop. It's got two names, this place. Take you around and show you inside. So we have some goods outside here, the leather jacket for ladies, leather bum bag, very beautiful. And then we've got the door opening out inside and then oh la la, we have a beautiful collection of leather goods inside here. Nice collection of leather jackets, ladies and men's. Also have some t-shirts here, as a Muhammad Ali t-shirt. And then just in the side here, have a beautiful collection of leather shoes also. Very nice. All the way along there. And then we have another collection of shirts here for men also. And then just up above there, we have a nice collection of bags. 
Okay, so this shop is split in two. Just in the middle here in the cabinet, we have a nice collection of leather purses and wallets. And then just to the side here, we have some like cowboy boots, many different designs available there. And then just in the back there, we have a beautiful collection of leather handbags, leather belts also. Many things available there. Okay, so just from Payne Louvre, a leather goods shop, just next door we have a place called Golden Bull Tattoo Studio, and then just next door to that we have Tropical Spa and Salon. And then just next door to Tropical Spa and Salon we have a place called Tommy's Calf, nearly got run over there, there's the name on the wall, Tommy, uh, is it Tommy's or Tommy's? Yeah, Tommy's. Tommy's Calf. And then this place is just about to close now because we're very late in the afternoon. And then there's the rest of the cafe inside. Nice collection of wooden tables and chairs, counter area in the back. Okay, so just across the street from Tammy's Calf and just next door on the same side of the street, we have Vineyard for your beer, wine and spirits. And then just next door to that, we have a new spa here called Claire Spa. Okay, so just next door to Claire Spa, we have a brand new um, pizza place called Pizza and Good. So we'll just take you across the street now to Pizza and Good. Pizza Roma Italian. So look at your pizza. And then here's the seating area in the back here. Nice collection of wooden tables and chairs. And then there's your counter area in the back there. Okay, so just from Pizza and Good, just across, directly across the street, we have a place called Chapter 2 Restaurant and Bar. Okay, so we're just going to go directly across the road. So here's the name up above, Chapter 2 Restaurant and Bar. Here's the breakfast. Here's your breakfast menu. Have a happy hour on all the cocktails, 50k, takeaway coffee, live music and then we'll take you around and show you inside. So there's the name up above, chapter two. Beautiful collection of wooden tables and chairs in here. Some soft cushion seating over to the side. Nice collection of tables down the center there. And there's a bar counter area in the back there. Okay, so just at the back of chapter two now, we have a nice big collection of tables and chairs all along the back here. And then just in the back here, we have a beautiful outside garden seating area. Okay, so chapter two is on this side, Pizza and Good is just there, and then just on the corner here now is a place called Sugar Ray's Bar and Restaurant. Okay, so we're just at the main entrance to Sugar Ray's now, just to give you a brief look inside. Nice collection of wooden tables and chairs here. Also some flat screen TVs up in the back there. And there's a span of your full inside of Sugar Ray's. Okay, so just across the street from Sugar Ray's now, on the opposite side of the street, we have a place called Bella Salon and Spa in the corner here. Some of what's available here at Bella Salon and Spa. There's also a little shop next door selling ladies' dresses and things. And then just on the corner here, we have the Kusanadi Hotel Leggy and Barley. Let me just take you inside the Kusanadi Hotel now. We have a parking area here at the front, cars and motorbikes. Our main reception desk is over to the left there, and then just here is where you're going to be serving your breakfast. Nice collection of tables and chairs. And then we'll take you through to the swimming pool area. Nice little pond water feature to the left there. And the one to the right here. Some of the rooms to the left and then there's a swimming pool area oh la la beautiful okay so just at the far end of the swimming pool here now at the Kusanadi some of the rooms on the side there Okay, so just coming out of Sugar Ray's now, we have a nice big collection of tourist goods shops all on this side of the street, also all on that side of the street. 
We'll just take you inside here and give you an idea of what's available here. So we have some sandals for the kiddies here. Many sandals in here also. Just in the back here we have a collection of sports shirts. All your AFL shirts there up above. Also some for the kiddies here. Have some nice kiddie shorts down below here. Ooh la la, Lakers, many different um, singlets there, and many in the back there. And then there's another side also to this shop, on this side it has a big collection of sunglasses, nice collection of um, sandals there, it also has a big collection of caps here, some um, little straining shoes for the kiddies here. And then many, many training shoes running all the way along the back there, all different brands. So there's just many, many, many shops along the street here, all selling very similar goods. Okay, so just from a collection of tourist goods shops now, on the same side of the street, we have the Baleka Hotel and Resort in the back there. I'll take you around and show you the swimming pool out, the Baleka. So here's like the car parking and driveway entrance. This is the main reception area here at the Baleka. I've already featured this in a full video as a seating area. Reception desk there at the back. Nice seating area here also. And now we'll take you down to where the pool and the rooms are located. So we've got to go down these stairs here, metal stairs. And left here into the beautiful tropical garden here's the rooms all along that's 3101 3102 3103 in the back there and then here's a swimming pool area nice collection of sun lounges some more here and there's a swimming pool Okay, so these are the classic room here, all along leading to the reception area, and then these are the lagoon rooms. 3106 this, 3107, 38, all along the back there, and there's your swimming pool. Okay, so just from the Baleka Hotel Resort and Spa there in the background, literally just next door, we have Barley Court Hotel and Apartments. There's the name up above on the wall there. Here's the reception desk to the left there. Nice little um, seating area. Here's your restaurant area. We have some steps down and there's your swimming pool. Table and chairs, the rooms all along the back there, up above in the back there, also on the side. Beautiful swimming pool area. Okay, so we're just coming out of Barley Court Hotel and Apartments now. We'll just take you back across the street. So there's the Baleka Hotel and Resort just next door. And then just across the street, we have a collection of tourist goods shops. We have G4 um, Spa and Salon. And then just next door to G4 Spa and Salon, we have a Clover Ink Tattoo Studio. Okay, so just from Clover Inc, G4 Spa and Salon, tourist goods shops on the corner there. We have a continuation of tourist goods shops along the street there and Mini Mart convenience starts, store further up the street. We'll just take you across the road and give you a brief look in here. So this guy's got a nice collection of sandals here. Many different types available in the back there. Many all around. Okay, so just from a sandals shop there that we've just been in, we have some more tourist goods shops here. This one here selling handbags. I'll just take you across the street and show you. There's two shops side by side here selling some clothes. Nice collection of ladies' clothes here, also made to order. 
any different dresses, many more in the back. And then just next door we have another one selling very similar goods with the ladies dresses again. Nice collection of different ladies dresses there. This one's also got a collection of handbags. And then just in the back there we have a collection of um, caps also. Okay, so just from a tourist goods shop there that we've just been inside, we have Motion Ink Tattoo Studio here. Just next door to that we have a Mini Mart convenience store. And then just next door to the Mini Mart convenience store we have another tourist goods shop selling sports football t-shirts. Okay, so just from a Mini Mart convenience store and a tourist goods shop next door, just across the street there, we have a place called Louis Dewey Beauty Spa Salon for all your massage and uh, beauty treatments. Okay, so just from Lou, Lulu Dewey and the salon and spa there, we have a place uh, called Skulls Nation. This is custom made jewellery and also tattoo. Just next door to that, we have Alvin Leather. It's a leather goods shop. You can see boots, bags, etc. in the shop there. And then just here, we have a money changer. Have a Dewey Fortuna retail and wholesale, ladies' clothing. And then just in the corner there, we have another money changer. Okay, so I'm just across the road at the money changer now. It is Sunday, so make allowance. These will be extremely low rates on this weekend. Okay, so just from a money changer and a little collection of shops there, Alvin Leather. Just on this side of the street, we have a place called Rena Satara Shop. This is another place selling a nice little collection of tourist goods there in the back. And then just turning around and making our way up the street, we have Moolia Cottage across the street there. Maybe that's an accommodation, not familiar with that one. And then just next door, we have Ying Yang Ink Barley. It's a tattoo studio. Let me just take you across the street to give you a close up on Ying Yang Ink Barley. So there's the name up above. There's the entrance. And then just next door, we have a place called Wahoo Trading. This place looks as though it's got a nice collection of decorative purses and goods for sale in here. Also some bags I see in there. Many bracelets and things inside. And so here's some of the bracelets in the window here. Have some fluffy feather bracelets. Okay, so just from Wahayu Trading there with all the purses, necklaces and bracelets just across the street. We have another collection of tourist goods shops on the corner here. Just take you across the street and give you a zoom in. Dream catchers up above there, many different designs. There's a nice collection of um, bags here, Louis Vuitton. Some more in the base there, nice collection of caps and hats there. Also has some sunglasses here, many more uh, dream catchers, some ladies dresses also, many more items in the back there, bracelets, necklaces I see, some more dream catchers there, nice collection of ladies pants there. Okay, so just from a tourist goods um, uh, shop on the corner there with all the dream catchers, we have a tourist information or tour booking service in the corner there. Another collection of tourist goods um, shops. However, we'll turn back to this um, side first. This is a place called Payum. This is another tourist goods shop. Just zoom in and give you a close up of what he's got here. Nice collection of bad bags here, handmade bags. Beautiful collection of smaller bags here and purses. And then just inside here, he has a nice collection of beautiful ladies sandals also. Another collection of bags inside. Have some more sandals on this side also. Also for men and ladies. Okay, so just from Payum shop there with all the tourist goods. Just in the back here, we have Christine's Salon and Spa. It's currently closed. Maybe that'll be open later. And then just next door, we have a place called Waris Leather. This is a leather goods shop. Impressive old bikes outside there, maybe for rental. Some skins there. Ooh la la, will you look at these? Some snakeskin shoes there. Snake skin in the bottom there. Wow. Many beautiful leather goods items in here. 
some cowboy boots there. And a beautiful collection of belts in the back there. Many more items inside. Okay, so just next door to Waris Leather, we have Sarindara Floris for all your flowers. If you're coming here for um, birthdays or wedding anniversaries, etc. We have a tailor next door for all your suits and also leather goods to see inside. And then just on this side of the street here, we have the Boss Legian Hotel. Take you around and show you inside. So it looks as though there's some basement parking down in the basement there. There's the name up above. This is the area leading to the reception. So here's a reception desk in the back here. And then just around the side here, here's the restaurant area. Okay, so just up here on the sixth floor now from the elevators at the Legian, uh, Boss Legian. I'm going to take you to the swimming pool area. So here's like the restaurant in the back there, and then here's the swimming pool area. Some steps down here, and just in the back we have a shallow pool here, and then a beautiful seating area here in the back. Okay, so just after taking you inside the Boss Legian Hotel, right next door, we have a place called Aquava Hotel and Villas. Okay, so just on the opposite side of the street, so there's the name now. There's some of the uh, breakfast set, 85K. Here's the restaurant eating area where you're gonna be served your breakfast. And then here's all the rooms in the back here. And there's the swimming pools. Just turn back to the rooms and give you a close up. There's the balconies, rooms look nice inside. Okay, so just coming out of Aquava Hotel and Villas, directly next door, we have a Circle K convenience store. Okay, so just across the street now at the Circle K store next to that door to Aquavar Hotel and Villas. Just turning back on the opposite side of the street, we have um, a couple of more leather goods shops. Yanto Shoes, leather specialist. Bell uh, Nin leather shoes and sandal made to order. Okay, a Circle K is on the left. The two leather goods shops across the street there. We have a place called Kalunkeu Fastbook there, I think that's how you pronounce it. And then just next door we have a very popular coffee shop called Coffee Cartel. Okay, so we'll just take you to the opposite side of the street here so you can see this more clearly. So there's the name up above, can't pronounce that really. And then here's some of the items available in the window. The shop's not currently open, it is Sunday. Nice collection of um, handmade stone decorative hearts there, some wooden ones in the window here also. Okay, so here's Cartel Coffee now, here's the outside seating area, we've just had to wait till it's a little bit more quiet. And now we take you around and show you inside. So there's a the counter area directly ahead of us, and then there's the inside seating area. Okay, so Coffee Cartel is literally the last place of interest on the street. We have a big construction, impressive building under construction on the opposite side there. And then now this is Jalan Legian at the end of the street here. Okay, so Caf Cartel in the white there, there's the un under construction building. And then just last on the street here, we have Ranting Florist. And then just from Ranting Florist now, we'll continue to the end of the street. Just on the right hand side here, there's a Laundry Express service if you need your laundry doing. And then now this is Jalan uh, Rea Legian. 
So you're going to find many shops and restaurants, etc. on this street. This way be heading towards Cooter area. There's a money changer across the street there. This way he's going to be heading to Seminyak. Okay, so just from a venture up Jalamwa Kadara along the street there, showing you all the hotels and everything. Now we're going to show you um, the beach options for you staying at these hotels in this location so one of the beach options is going to be along Jalan Padma Utah in that direction we'll take you and show you that one after however first of all we're going to turn left and head in this direction okay so just from turning left now we're back at the entrance to the Jayakarta Bali that's in the back there there's the coffee cutters on the right hand side we're going to continue walking along the street here Okay, so just after walking the straight line from the Jayakarta Coffee Cutters Term Coffee Shop, we have Hotel Kamala Pantai on the corner here. And then just on the corner here, we have Sue's Cottages. Okay, so we'll just take you inside and show you around the swimming pool area here at Sue's Cottages. So there's the name on the wall there. And then we're just going to go in through the main, sorry, just through the main entrance area here. So these are the rooms to the side here, some more rooms to the side there, and then here's your swimming pool area. So there's another angle on your swimming pool area, all the rooms are up all around the courtyard garden setting. Sue's Cottages also has its own little calf just by the side of Sue's Cottages. Okay, so just from Sue's Cottages now, we're going to continue along the street here. Okay, so Sue's Cottages is just on the left there. Now you're going to turn right around the street here. Okay, so you're going to pass an authorised money changer on the right there. You're going to pass a little um, shop on the uh, right there also. And then we have Ayu Spa and Beauty Salon across the street there. And then you're going to head down this little um, alleyway here. So we're just walking down the alleyway, just walking a complete straight line. Okay, so just after walking in a complete term straight line along the street there, now you'll arrive at this point. So you're going to have the Queen Salon and Spa on your right hand side there, and then just across the street there's the entrance to Legian Beach. So it's morning here now at Legian Beach, so it's not going to be too much open. Have this pathway in the back of the beach, all the little stalls at the back selling drinks and um, snacks. A nice collection of um, seating here, plastic chairs, wooden tables, umbrellas. Okay, so there's a close-up on your tables and chairs, what to expect here. And then just to the left also, there's some soft cushion beanbag style seating there. You could sat down on that. And then just near the ocean, we have a collection of sun loungers, wooden sun loungers, soft cushion tops. And then there's the ocean. Let's give you a span from right to left. So this is going to be heading up to Semiak Double Six Beach. Okay, so just after turning right, of, of coming out of Jalamwa Kadara from all the hotels and restaurants, now we're going to turn left and head in this direction. Okay, so just after walking in a straight line along Jalam Padma Utara from the Zest Hotel on the corner, you'll arrive here at uh, Romeo's on the right hand side. We have a place called Coffee Terry on the left hand side. Directly opposite you is going to be Kima Farm Apotic, Calf Magnum and then we're going to take the road down here along the side of Romeo's and Oz Hotel. Okay, so just on the left here is the Bandha and then you're looking for this sign here, Beach Access. We're going to take this route down here. Okay, so after just walking in a straight line now, you're going to have your first turning to the right. And then next, we've just had a short walk and then we're going to turn to the left. And then just another little short walk and then we're going to turn to the right again. Okay, so just after walking down the long alleyway now, we're arriving at the beach here. So we have a road along the back of the beach here. Just in the back here is a place called Burger Buzz. However, it's early morning, so it's not open yet. 
and then you're just going to look for these gates here leading through to uh, Legian Beach. So we've got surf lessons available here, we've got this track that runs all the way along the back of the beach, all the stores selling you drinks and snacks etc. Tiger Richie Bumba. Voila. Uncle Uncle Bar, you look thirsty. And then here's the nice beach area. So you've got a lot of um, beanbag style seating here on the beach here in this location. Even have a swing here, Tiger Richie Bumba. And just by the ocean here, we have a nice collection of wooden sun lounges, soft cushion seating, umbrellas. And there's your ocean. Okay, so I'm just close down by the water's edge now. Lots of surfers out in the distance there. Give you a span from right to left. It's very early morning, this beach is usually very popular, 